Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Euro Truck Simulator 2. It's been some time, um, the last one was the, the Stobart Christmas, which was before Christmas Day. Uh, I think the last one was on Christmas Eve. So yeah, it has, it has been some time. Uh, I'm glad to be back. I am still not well, and some of you might know I've, uh, I've been ill. But um, I'm, I'm slowly getting back and feeling better. But I thought, you know what? I'm not going to leave you out. I'm not going to leave you without a Euro Truck video for uh, too long. So uh, I've got to get back into the swing of things. And if you remember, if you did watch this store about Christmas, you'll know we're in a... Where are we? <laughs> we're in the place we, um... We left off. Liege. And we are taking a store about trailer. I think it's a double deck trailer, actually. I'm not sure. I know it's Tesco. on the back, it says TS just for test code. Okay. No worries. And we're going to Dusseldorf, which is 103 mile away. Not that bad for the uh, New Year trip. The first trip of the New Year. So we might as well uh, get talking now. I mean, there is quite a bit to talk about. Uh, let's, let's. I suppose we'll start off. Um, what did you think to the Istobart Christmas? The little special I did, um, delivering Xmas gifts. Um, I think people enjoyed it. From what I'd uh, seen, um, like the comments and whatever. Um, they were, it basically, it didn't go at all how I um, planned, and nothing I really do ever goes to plan, but that it was like, it was the last minute thing, it really was, I was like, because when it got announced, basically all it was, if you don't know about it, it was, this event SES was doing, and it was to deliver Xmas gifts, um, the distance equivalent of from SCS office, which is in uh, Prague, Czech Republic, to the North Pole, and it's something like 2,400 miles. And basically, I had to do that while delivering these Xmas gifts and Xmas gifts only. There was a, a job in the job market, and not just one, obviously, there's loads. And it said Xmas gifts, and it was a trailer with like Xmas. The picture on it, and yeah, um, you had to you had to deliver two thousand four hundred miles worth of those uh, Xmas gifts, and my plan was to do it over like the course of a week or a bit more when it first got announced, and I just kept putting it off because I was busy. This car's gonna pull out. See. You just caused an accident, prick. I didn't damage the trailer, I'm actually not bothered. <laughs> um. So yeah. And w when it got announced I was going to like do it over a week, but I just kept putting it off because I was busy and doing things. And it come to the, it come to the, um, like the last weekend before Christmas, it's like I need to get this done because the achievement was to do this this certain distance and then you got a um, 
an exclusive DLC only if you did this, uh, this event thing. I was like, well, I want to get this exclusive DLC. I need to get this done. Now, I could have done it off camera. I had hours and hours to spare when I wasn't recording. I could have done it easily, but I wanted to do it on camera because I thought it was, you know, it's something special. Not really had a Christmas special thing planned, so do that. And, yeah, so, um, it was like, it was the last minute thing. It, it, it came to that last week, and uh, when did I upload the first one? Is it a Saturday or a Sunday? I can't remember. Oh no, I think it was a Sunday. I oh, know it was a Saturday, but it didn't actually go out on Saturday. It went out on Sunday. I think three went out on Sunday or Monday or something. It was ridiculous. And I was going to do all these fancy edits. And if you saw in the first one, I did like I edited over every delivery that I'd finished. And but that, that was all that was all good, and I could have done that. But it, it took like two hours to render one like one hour. Of video footage that's just to render then I had to export it which probably took another hour then compress it which it would have took about an hour and a half and then upload it and uploading an hour's uh, video which is oh, I don't know how, how big a file but you know and it just kept building up and up and I just couldn't do it so um, it, it was like a quick um, cut it up in another software, in another program that I use. It's quick and easy, and compress it, and that was it, and then upload. Um, yeah, but I, th I think it, I think it, you know, it went well. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed that. I I, I enjoyed making it, but though it was tiring, it did kind of like kick it out of me a bit. But yeah, that's that. So then Christmas, Christmas came. Did a Christmas vlog. Um, showed you what, or showed you a bit what I got for Christmas. I couldn't show you all because a lot of it is still downstairs from because I'm recording on Christmas night. I just got like I just like gathered as much stuff I could, and I just showed you. Um, yeah, did a Christmas vlog then. Kinda didn't really do anything for the next week. I mean, it, it was Christmas after all. Let's be fair. It's like you don't really work Christmas. So, um, hmm. yeah, you're gonna go because you just hit me anyway. What type of truck is he driving? you good sir. Oh, was that a Renault that let me out? So yeah, and then didn't really do much, um, just uh, Farmer Simulator 15 mod show or whatever. Then come New Year. Um, yeah. Um, I did a... <laughs> this is funny. I did a New Year's Day vlog. And... I, at the time, it was well. It was new. I did. It was New Year's Eve, New Year's Day. I, I did the vlog on New Year's Eve, and it was going to go out New Year's Eve. Yeah, that uh, New Year's Day. Sorry, uh, that didn't go to plan. Um, I edited it on uh, New Year's Day, but then when I edited it, it did something funny to the video. It just the edit completely failed. It just messed up the video. So I'm like. Now, this edit, the more edits you put on a video, the longer it's going to take to render, because it has to render more, um, you know, things. Whoa! Did you see that crash, then? See if I can get to that. If not, I'll, uh... Just crash over here. Oh, I can't get to it. Balls. Just that bush has ploughed straight to that car. Oh, what is going on here? Oh, still that truck just waiting there. You know what? This uh, causes for me to take action. Right. Yeah, sorry, but 
you know, dumb freaking AI. Get out of my way. Not damaged the trailer, I'm happy. So yeah, um, <laughs> didn't go out New Year's Day, this video, because I, I didn't, by the time it finished editing and that, uh, rendering, and then exported out, I had to compress it, but it was like a 10 minute video, so 10 minute videos don't take that long to compress, that wasn't a problem. Neither was uploading, but it, it come to like 11 o'clock at night, by the time it had done. And I just didn't have time, so I um, the next day I just did like a quick chop up video in that other software that I use, um, and compress it and upload it, and that was it. So you didn't get the ending or everything that I do with the vlogs, which I, I suppose is fine. And that had like it did have a a positive kind of reaction to it despite me um, failing to get it out when I said it would go out. But I did apologise in the description and explain why. And then, oh, was it was it that day or was it the day after? I can't remember. Um, excuse me a minute. That's a flu coming back. Um, I can't remember, was it the day, that day or the day after? Um, I hit 1,000 subscribers now. That, and I've mentioned this, is nothing. It is, it is nothing to anybody else, but it's the biggest, one of the biggest things that's ever happened to me so far. Because I see having 1,000 subscribers is like, is like having 1,000 friends, and I've never had that. So, yeah, I, I, I need to do like a, a vlog for that as well. Um. That'll come in the next week sometime. I just wanna, I wanna get back into making gameplay videos. I, I haven't been properly making gameplay videos for a month. So yeah, I wanna, I wanna get back into that swing before I, uh, I do anything else. Got some good stuff planned for this year though. Can't tell you yet, but. I, a lot of it is going to be down to you. You decide. So, I will ask you now and again, what do you, do you want me to do this, do you want me to do that, and you will decide. It's up to you, because at the end of the day, you're the people that are watching them, not me. I'm the one that makes it, and if I enjoy making it, so, lo so long as I enjoy making it, I will do it. And that's it, and the rest is up to you. If I don't enjoy doing it, I won't do it. Just gotta get that straight. But I think I think we got that anyway, I think you know that. And here we are, DHL. Looks like there's some couple of stuff going out of here. Wow. Did I just hit that trailer? I freaking did. I knew I did. Oh. Yeah. All that time we went through all that traffic and smashed up by different like other cars and AI. And then that. That's like that's a prime example of falling at the la uh, you know tripping at the last hurdle or whatever it's called. <laughs> oh dear! Don't win it. That, I'm not bothered. Satisfactory. <laughs>
Oh well. Uh, might as well just leave it like that. And yeah, ladies and gentlemen, um, put the middle wheel. Up. There we go. Yeah, that is it uh, for this episode of Yogurt Simulator 2. 15 minutes, not that bad. Um, it's better than an hour on the last ones. I think they do get kind of boring when they're that long. Especially when you like when you're doing like five episodes and there's like when you come to like the fourth and fifth episode, there's just nothing to talk about. But yeah, uh, that is it. Thank you for watching. Please like, favorite, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. For some more Eurojet Simulator Two. Ta-ra.